quick list review. Hi, Adam Payne here with the Video Marketing Insider. In today's video, we are gonna be looking at a brand new web-based software called Quicklist, which really, really helps building laser targeted email lists. And we all know that if you can build a list and then build a relationship with that list, regardless of what niche you're in, then you can make a lot of money very quickly. So without further ado, let's go and look inside the members area and let me show you why I think this is really, really cool. Okay, so here we are over at the sales page for Quicklist. And what Quicklist is in short, it's a web-based software that allows you to quickly and easily create interactive digital checklists without being technical in any way, shape or form. This is really, really useful because this will allow you to create lead magnets that you can use to build a list. Now, we all know that building a list is really important. However, creating lead magnets that are of value to your audience is quite a time consuming process if you want to create something decent to give away in exchange for an email address. And this is where Quicklist comes in. I've been creating interactive digital checklists manually for some time now. I'll give you an example. This is one that's inside of my video marketing inside a membership site. And this is all about Facebook video ads. I've got these on a variety of different topics. Some I give to my members for free, but others I use for list building. And this talks all about the steps people need to take when they're setting up Facebook video ads. So they can go through and they can check these things off when they've done them. I don't have the technical skills to create a checklist like this that looks nice. So I have to outsource this, which means it takes time. And of course I have to pay each time I want one of these checklists created. I could probably stumble through it and you know, it would give me stress, it would take me time. And at the end of the day, I'd probably give up and then still have to pay someone to do it. Now to have these done consistently, again, it can cost you a bit of money. Every time I make a how-to video, for example, I try to create a congruent lead magnet. So if somebody comes to YouTube or Google and types in how to create video ads, uh, Facebook video ads, and they see my video, for example, I would encourage them at different points throughout the video to click on the link to get my Facebook video ads checklist. It's congruent with the content that they are consuming, which means the opt-in rate is much higher than if it was a generic lead magnet. But of course, creating these again takes time. And that's what attracted me to Quicklist because if I thought, if I could have a way to quickly and easily create these and they look slick, it would save me time, save me money, and then I could just you know go about my business doing other things. Here we are inside of Quicklist. I have review access, but this is not review access only for me. This is for a bunch of other affiliates as well. So there are certain things I can show you, but I can't actually do, and that'll become apparent. So first of all, I'd like to show you the different integrations that Quicklist has. So if we click on this, and then we click on add an integration in this drop down menu, you will see that it integrates with a bunch of different email services. Now that's because they also provide landing pages and opt in pages too. On a personal level, I'm not gonna be using them because I have other page builders that are more advanced, that have more templates, and you probably do so as well. But this is there if you want them. You can see you've got Aweber Active Campaign, pretty much every main email service around. There's a bunch of webinar services as well, Demio, um, Webinar Jam, Evernar, Web Ever Webinar, and you can also set up your tracking as well, so you can integrate your Facebook Pixel and your Google Tag Manager, amongst other things. I think those would be the two main things. So you've got those options if you want to. There's also a WordPress plugin, so we'll click on that. You can download the plugin here, and then you can install it like you would any normal WordPress plugin. You will need to connect it with an API key, and you can get that under my account. So if you wanted to create these pages and have them on your own web WordPress website, this is how you would do it. And they've got a few bonuses, which I'm not gonna look at, support and your account, and you can log out here. But let's click on folders. Now, on the front end, I believe you get 10 templates, but you can edit these templates. If you wanna get more, they do have an upgrade and a template club and all of that stuff. I'll show you the funnel in a second. But what we can do is we can come down here and let's just open up the default one. You can see these ones are ones that other affiliates have created. Now, when the default tab opens, I'll show you how simple and easy it is to play around and edit these checklists so that you can you know, do what you want with them. So as you can see here, if you wanted to use their own opt-in pages and landing pages, you can see your leads, your opt-in rate and all of that stuff. Somebody's obviously been playing around with this one, which is totally cool. So I'm not gonna edit it, but I do wanna click on editor to show you what you would need to do. So they've designed a checklist like this um, and you can kind of come down and you can kind of check these things 
when you've done them. So if I was to receive this as a lead magnet, I could go through these things and I could um, you know, check them off if I've done them. Now, if I was editing this, there's a few things I could do. I could come to all of these things. I could delete one of these if, they didn't, if it didn't make sense. I could edit it, so I could click on that and I could change the title and the text. If I wanted to, I could hit this little plus button and I can also um, play around with it here. If we click on this, I can even embed a video so I can get a regular YouTube URL or a Vimeo URL. I can put a hyperlink. So it's really, you know, pretty, it's pretty cool the amount of stuff we can do. And I think if I click on this one, we'll see that somebody's already embedded a video here. So you could have individual steps and then you could even provide a video on how to implement these steps. So it would kind of be like a mini course if you wanted to put that much effort into that. If we come up to the top, uh, we can reorder the section, so we can kind of move this below this if you wanted to. Uh, if we click on this, we can add a section. So this has got one section here, uh, one section here, one section here. We can add a section. If we click on the settings, um, we can change the title, uh, we can change the heading, the subheading, we can change the colors here. This is where we um, connect it to an opt-in form. So there's a bunch of different things we can do. We can add footer links. So if you want to put the link to your website URL here, you can do that. Now you may have seen this one, uh, remove branding. This is the only negative that I really see with Quicklist. You need to get upgrade number one to have the ability to remove branding. Now, if you're just using this for yourself, it's not a big deal. I mean, every time we send emails, you can see at the bottom, it says it's from Aweber or it's from GetResponse. A lot of landing pages like Convertry and ClickFunnels have their badges on there. So it's not a huge deal, but if you wanted to really you know, brand it properly, or you wanted to create these for your customers or clients, or even sell these on Fiverr or a freelance site, then you'd probably want to include your customers' logos on there. Then of course you would need to get the upgrade. And you probably would get your money back really, really quickly, but in order for you to have that um, option, then yeah, you are going to need to, uh, upgrade if you want to do that so we can just hit cancel there so there's all these different things you can do you can kind of come down you can see this is where the footer links would appear um, if you want to see what it looks like on different um, devices this is desktop this would be on a tablet and this would be on mobile so you can see on mobile the branding is quite big um, so obviously you'd scroll down and that's what it looked like so it is mobile responsive it does look nice but if a lot of your traffic is going to be mobile, then you'd want to make sure that you know it did look nice on mobile as well. Now these forms, uh, these checklists, I should say, you can download the HTML. Um, you can get an iframe and you can embed it. So you could embed it in your membership site or your WordPress blog, whatever. You can download the HTML if you're good with HTML and you can play around with it that way. You can turn the HTML into a document. You could probably host these on Amazon S3 or another cloud. You know, service. There's tons of things you can do. And again, I'm not, I personally don't think this is the uh, main point of Quicklist, but they do provide opt in forms you can see, and they do provide a few landing page templates as well. And it's very easy to use. You can upload images, you can get rid of stuff. It's like a lot of these page builders. But for me personally, I think there are better page builders out there and most people probably have Convertry or ClickFunnels or Thrive Themes or something else that they can use. This is all about the checklist. So having these nicely designed templates, all I need to do really is come in and just change the title, change the subheading and come through here and either delete or add things and I've got a checklist ready to go. Then I can download it. I can um, embed it on a membership site. I can host it in the cloud. And if you want to, they give you links that you can host it as well. So if you want to use quick, li quick list hosting, there's that as well. It's really entirely up to you. But the big value is doing this quickly because then you can create these on the fly. It might take you 10 minutes to create one. And then you've got a nice professional looking lead magnet that you can offer people. Now, as my, I've got a couple of bonuses, but before I do, I want to take you through the um, funnel. So if we click on this, it's between $37 and $67. Now, if you get in at the start of when this product goes live, and I'll leave the information of that below this video, it'll be $37 and it'll gradually rise during the launch. They do have a mini list building course, but honestly speaking, I've not seen it, so I can't tell you if it's a good course, a bad course and what kind of list building they're advocating. This is the upgrade, you can get 99 bucks or you can have two, pay, two payments of $57 where you get the ability to clone and have all the branding. 
And if you don't want this, you've got a $67 um, down sell. And then you've got the second upgrade, which is the template club. And then they've got the down sell for that as well. So for me personally, I would get the front end, of course. And if I could stretch to it that, you probably don't need these template clubs, but it's entirely up to you. The only reason I would say get this if you can afford it is because it allows you to remove the branding. You can brand it to you. You can brand it to customers and clients and you can sell these at price of your choosing. When I first came online, uh, I bought a landing page builder way before ClickFunnels and Convertry was around and I sold a landing page for $100 and then I just went into one of the softwares, created a landing page, delivered it to that person, 100 bucks, there you go. And that was years ago. So having the ability to create these, you could sell these for five, 10, 15, 20, 30 dollars a go, and you could easily make a nice little side income. But if not, just use it for yourself. Now I did mention bonuses. Now if you click below this video, it'll take you to my written review where I go through the bonuses in more detail. I'm gonna be giving a couple of things. I'm gonna be giving my own um, list building training as well. I'm gonna give you some ideas on how you can use this for congruent list building. And there'll also be a little tracking bonus as well, because whenever you're building leads, you need to be able to track stuff. And you don't need to invest in third-party tracking tools. Um, I'm gonna be giving access to a Google Tag Manager um, over the shoulder guide as well. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns, but this is quick list. I think it's really cool. It's different, it's unique, and it allows you to create these checklists quickly and easily. Any questions, comments, concerns, let me know below. I hope you like this video. I hope this review helps you. Uh, give me a like, subscribe to the channel if you've got time. Give me a hit on the bell notification and all of that fun stuff. And I'll see you soon. Take care. Thank you for watching. If you've got any questions or you need more clarification, go and watch the video once more. Over on the right hand side, we have some more trainings and reviews. So go and watch those as well. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already, and hit the bell notification. Other than that, ask any questions you've got below, and I'll see you soon.